is. The first croaker. So all I have working here today, I just have a little pompano rig, one out sinker, and I'm just fishing the trough right here, you know, five, six feet out for uh, croakers and whitings and whatever else is in there. You don't have to cast too far. There you go, a little croaker. Here we go. Ah, I got something different. <laughs> I thought that was fighting a little funny. It's a little spot. <laughs> oh, what a great day for doing this. Come on, let go. Let go. They're pretty neat looking. What do we have here? Another croaker. There he is. He's a he's a great snook bait. All right. Croakers and croakers and more croakers. Come here, buddy. These little guys are delicious, by the way. I'm not keeping any, but <clears throat> they are. I don't blame the snook for liking them so much. There he is. See ya. Alright. Surprise. Another croaker. Oh, they are thick in here today. Come on. Let me show him how pretty you are and I'll let you go. Here he is. Nice little croaker. Oh! Sorry about that guy. Here, go! There he goes. Croaker, croaker, croaker. 
There he is. Slippery little fella. See ya! Well, if you ever decide to go croaker fishing, you don't have to pitch it out too far. So here's my little rig, a couple teeny tiny shrimp. Literally just pitching it out underhanded and then taking a few steps back. That's all I'm doing. What do we have here? This guy's pulling a little different. I was hoping to show you maybe some baby permit. But, I guess all that's around today is spots and croakers. Oh well. At least my rod's bending. This one feels a little bigger. Sure would like to catch a different species. No. Just another spot. Dang it. about as tired of uh, catching croakers and spots as you probably are watching. So, <laughs> I think that's it for me for today. But until next time, we'll see you then. Alright, bye-bye.